All right, so today we're going to look at a stable diffusion on Unraid. I recently upgraded my video card and my main system. So I had an old 1060 GeForce that wasn't doing anything. So I threw it in my Unraid box and then I figured I'd install stable diffusion. Because I'm not an artist, but I do have some ideals that I would like to see. So I installed stable diffusion for I can actually look at some artwork on some ideals. So if I want to type in a cartoon karate cat, I could do that. And then I could sit there and run this to actually get that image up there. So let's give this a second and see what it comes up with. Alright, so here what we got is we got my cartoon karate cat. Um, it looks like it's a Kiatai cat. Um, but you can see that it's trying to get the little karate uniform on him, and he is a cat, so I guess it worked. Um, it's a lot better than what I would draw, um, because again, you know, I'm no artist. I can barely draw a stick figure, so if I wanted to put stuff in here, um, this kind of helps me out a lot. Um, now I could change this number of images, but for my video card, since it's a lower end video card, um, I can get maybe one or two images um, after that. I've run out of memory, so i got to keep mine pretty low. And we can change the steps and the height and the width um, and kind of get all this thing, you know, tweaked in the way that we want it. Um, but again, you know, 512 works best for me. If I try to get a little bit higher than that, um, I run out of memory because, again, I have a low video card in this. So, <clears throat> but... You know, it works for me, and, you know, I'll play with it. So if you guys want to see how this gets set up, um, stay tuned, and we'll get right into it. All right, so once you log into your Unraid machine, um, right now I'm in my Docker tab, and I don't have any stable diffusion. So what I want to do is I want to go over here to Apps, click on Apps, and then I just want to type in Stable diffusion. And then once I have stable diffusion in here, I have a couple of different ones. Um, I have not tried this AI bot. I haven't tried that one out. This one here, this stable diffusion, um, I cannot get it to work myself. Um, I think it might be because my video card um, is just not compatible with this one or I just have the settings messed up. But this one over here with the little blue paint, I got this one to work. So all we got to do is install it. And it just says that you had an additional requirement in the Vata Driver plugin. Um, if you don't know how to install your uh, video drivers, um, I do have another video on that that I'll put at the end of the video. And then we'll just hit OK. And then we go down here. Um, you can sit there and get your video information and do the GPU dash and have that long number, but I only have one video card in here, so all just works for me. And we just go down here and hit apply. And then once this thing's applied, you know, we should be um, pretty much up and running. So let this finish installing and then we'll be right back. All right, so now that we have this installed, <clears throat> all we got to do is go over here, hit done. And then we'll go back over here to our Docker container, and it's right here. And what I like to do is I like to come up here and hit logs just to make sure everything is loaded before we start it. So let's give this a second and make sure everything gets loaded properly. All right, so now that this is um, done, we can just close this out. And then we'll go over here to Stable Diffusion, and we'll just go to Web UI and right up here everything's set up and again you know this time we're going to do a credit dog cartoon and then we're just going to generate the image and then we're going to see how well this thing does a credit dog that's a cartoon all right so now that we got everything up and running we've got a credit dog up here I'm not sure how much that looks like a dog but again it's better than what I would draw um, let's try one more. Let's try a cartoon ninja of Mike Tyson. Uh, bring back some interesting results. 
So let's see what that looks like. Um, this, you know, now that it's up and running, it looks like it's going through a little bit quicker. So we'll see how this, um, you know, plays out. All right, so we got it up here. Um, you know, I guess it produced um, Mickey Tisk, I guess. But, you know, it's a little guy, and I guess I can see him trying to be a ninja. At least he's a fighter, I guess. Um, but that's pretty much it. I'm talking about you can put in anything you want in here, just play with it, and then kind of come up um, with um, your own solutions. All right, I am kind of curious what you guys come up with. So if you come up with the link below, um, put it in the comments, and, um, you know, I'll see you next time.